During the first quarter of fiscal year 2015, we advanced our progress in our legacy areas of projects, customer, community, people, and safety. We demonstrated our commitment to safety 24-7 in our community at local schools. 24-7 safety is the most important thing to us. After School Matters is an employee-driven program that teaches children about Hanford careers and safety at home and at work. We renewed the emphasis on stretch and flex with a goal to increase participation by 25%. And with winter on the way, we launched our annual winter driving safety campaign. Empowering employees to achieve career goals, CH2M Hill's management team began a phased approach to removing obstacles in the field to support fieldwork supervisors and empower them for success. The effort will break down barriers for fieldwork supervisors and help grow them into tomorrow's leaders. And during the last quarter, we expanded the Leadership Impact Initiative to Leaders Without a Title. A recent CH2M Hill Corporate Ethics Assessment found that generally, CHPRC's policies, procedures, programs, and monitoring were designed effectively with only minor opportunities noted. CHPRC hired the first in a series of co-ops this fall. The WSU Tri-Cities and Columbia Basin College students receive real-world, on-the-job experience while helping us achieve our mission. At the Plutonium Finishing Plant Closure Project, a major accomplishment as all of the glove boxes in the main part of the facility are now off ventilation and ready for disposal. Progress continues elsewhere at PFP with the facility overall about three quarters of the way ready for demolition. At 100K, a major accomplishment for project technical services and decommissioning waste fuels and remediation services with the completion of the outer shell of the sludge basin annex. The project completed testing of some of the components to be used for sludge transport and removal and awarded a contract for some of the equipment needed to move and store sludge. The Soil and Groundwater Remediation Project advanced its mission to remove uranium from groundwater by revising the 200 West Pump and Treat Operations and Maintenance Plan that incorporates the new uranium system and by completing drilling for the two extraction wells for the uranium plume. The project also began testing methods to safely and compliantly drill wells to sample soil and water from areas beneath the K-East former fuel storage basin. For our customer, we are pioneering this strategy for risk mitigation and cleanup by entering and evaluating the Redox Canyon in the center of the site to make future cleanup recommendations to the Department of Energy. Environmental program and strategic planning began the regulatory process for mitigating risks at the waste encapsulation and storage facility by submitting a permit request for ventilation upgrades and grouting of six hot cells that are no longer in use. Prime contract and project integration completed a root cause evaluation to identify improvements to the earned value management system. Many CHPRC employees invested their time in our community during the last quarter by helping expand the Badger Mountain Trail system. It gives me a sense of uh, knowing that people that use the trail, whether it be in another month, another year, another 10 years, 50 years, are gonna have a, a safe place to go and hike. CHPRC employees also contributed to the United Way and showed their generosity by fundraising and contributing food and gifts for the holidays. Our work in the first three months of the new fiscal year further demonstrates CHPRC's continued commitment to our community, our employees, and our work here at Hanford.